Creating accessible documents with the accessibility sidebar. You are creating inaccessible documents and you are not even aware of it. When you create your documents, you create them in such a way that they look good, but not necessarily that they are accessible for people using a screen reader. I want to introduce you to a tool that helps you not only create good-looking documents, but also accessible documents for all people to read. Two reasons why you need to use the accessibility sidebar. First, it will help you become aware of uh, possible accessibility issues in your document. And second, it will help you fix those issues. As a result, you will be able to create not only good-looking documents, but documents which are accessible for all users. Let's have a look at one example document. We have this nice document and want to create a PDF out of it. And there we have a nice checkbox which says universal accessibility and hitting that checkbox will create a special PDF which is yeah, especially well made for people with visual impairment. It follows the requirements of the PDF UA standard. Taking that, that box and exporting shows us that there are 18 accessibility issues. Of course, we want to investigate those issues, and that takes us straight to the Accessibility Check sidebar deck. You will also find that deck by going to Tools, Accessibility Check, or by clicking this button in the sidebar, Accessibility Check. There we have a number of uh, problems reported in various categories. First, we have document level options. We have no document title set. This sidebar would, will not only show you what the problem is, but it will also guide you to fixing those. And here is a fix button where you can enter the document title directly. It says you should avoid background images. OK, our beautiful cloudy background needs to go. This fix button will take you right to the area top of the page style dialog and you can switch the background off. It says the styles need to have a, a language set. This would take you to the paragraph style. Then we have shapes which have no description or alt text set. We can fix it right here and set an alternative text. Then we would have uh, table cells which are empty. That should not happen. Please remove them. There is text formatting that conveys additional meaning. Please no direct formatting. There is new lines that are used to create space. Margin should be used instead, paragraph margin. There is a hyperlink text with the same as the link address. Please use a different text and not just put the link in the text. There is numbering, which is yeah, manual and not using the proper numbering feature. And there is footnotes, which should not be there. There is also content control in this footer, which should be avoided. Outline level, it's very important. Please start with level 1, not level 2, and go uh, sequentially, not jump from level 2 to level 4. Then please, if you have fields, use interactive input fields and not just put some dots or underlines there. If you have tables, they should not contain headings, says the UA specification. In this place, the text contrast is too low. And if you have frames or text boxes, please anchor them as characters so that the screen reader can announce, announce them at the right place. So this sidebar deck, as you see, will not only show you what kind of issues your document might have, but it will also guide you directly to the places where those issues occur and help you fix those issues. This will help you create not only to create not only good-looking documents, but also accessible documents.